What's up, YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug, and I'm back again with my Ninja Speedy. We got a simple one for you today that you and the kids will love. Today, for you guys, we're gonna make some easy pepperoni pizza. All we're using is some tortillas, whatever pasta sauce or pizza sauce of your choosing. I got that from Aldi. Um, some pepperonis. And I have a mozzarella cheese mix. You could use just plain mozzarella in a bag, shredded. That's fine, too. And by the way, guys, if you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. It's free. I promise. Now, a lot of my subscribers and viewers know that I'm a diabetic. But that's not the only reason why I'm using this Mission Carb Balanced Low Carb Flour uh, Tortilla or Soft Taco, as the bag says. The reason why I'm using this is this fits, this particular size fits your Ninja Speedy perfectly. Because there's all sorts of different sizes of tortillas. And if you get the large one, it'll be too big for your Speedy. Because you know the Ninja Speedy is compact. So this fits your air fryer tray perfectly. So why not make this guilt free and join me and get this brand? Because there's really no difference in taste between regular tortillas and low carb tortillas, to be honest, in my opinion. The recipe that I'm following, they actually did it in a Ninja Grill. They put in their air fryer basket and just made it right in there, which was cool. But we're doing it in the Speedy today. I'm going to take it a step further because I like a crispy crust. This part you do not have to do. I'm going to put this on sear and saute. For five minutes so three minutes on one side and two on the other all right that's three minutes on one side I'll flip it do two minutes on the other side all right five minutes is up went ahead and turned it off and take it right off so see you have two sides of a nice crust so I think I'm gonna use this as the bottom and put my toppings on that side. And remember, we're gonna use two tortillas for this. So this is my other tortilla. And again, if you want to skip that step, then you would just join in from right here. This is what I'm using, but again, any pasta or pizza sauce will be just fine. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on here. You don't wanna soak it in there. Just. Put a nice layer. All right, something like this. And this is optional as well, you know, because I have all the pasta sauce. I feel I could give it some help by putting in some, uh, putting on some Italian seasoning, totally optional. Or we'll put whatever seasoning you like to add, or don't add any. Your pizza sauce or pasta sauce is good enough. Now I'm going to add my cheese, and like I said, mozzarella cheese, plain mozzarella cheese shredded is fine. I have a combination that works as well. I chose the combination because it's just more flavor, but regular mozzarella will be just fine. Get the point, and we're going to do this to both, both tortillas. All right, guys, something like this. And I'm not going to add my pepperonis just yet. I'm going to air fry these for about six minutes. And I'm going to add my pepperonis at the three minute mark. Because my pepperonis are very thin. Um, and they'll just fly around if I put them in just, you know, right now at this point. Alright, I got the bottom tortilla in. I'm going to put the top right on it. You could layer it and put them all in together. However you want to do it's fine. But it's pretty flimsy. So I suggest you do it you know, one at a time. All right, so let's get it closed. All right, so let's get this on here. We're gonna put it to air fry, and it's at 390, that's exactly what I want. I'm gonna do six minutes, and I'll be back at three to add my pepperonis. All right, guys, so that three minutes have passed. I'm ready to put on my pepperonis and we are going to press these babies on there nice and good. Press, press, press. You get the point. Smelling good, guys. All right, something like that, guys. And I'm just gonna take my rack. I'm just gonna place it right on top. 
All right. Three minutes left. This could be you guys. Six minutes of your life. You see it. You saw it, guys. It was just two tortillas. That's it. So I'm going to take it out with my hand just to show you. Watch out for the edges, of course. Boom. Now, I'll be honest with you. Most of us can just eat this without even cutting it, right? <laughs> no need to cut it. But just for the sake of this video, I'm going to do that. But one thing's for sure, kids are going to love this. And it's super easy to make. Anybody can make this. Shout out to my viewers and subscribers that hit the like button way before my video is even finished. I appreciate that. Alright guys, you saw the paper towel go up. That means it's time to eat. So we're going to analyze this guys. You know the bottom is good. And see, it's not flip-flopping all over the place. Anywho, you get the first bite. You got it? Mmm. Still hot. Oh, that's good. Mmm. That Italian seasoning, oh yeah. I'll say, if you got it, do it. See that? Mm. Game changer right here, guys. It's perfect. We'll take a bite of one more before we get out of here. And remember, these are low-carb tortillas, so this is guilt-free. No worries at all. Let's analyze the bottom. See that? Perfect. Get it. Mmm. So good. Oh, and if you don't have one of these, I'll try and leave a link in the description so you can pick up one. If you don't already have one. Most of you do. That was just too easy, guys. Taste absolutely fantastic. You and your family will enjoy this one. Trust me. And anybody can make this. The kiddos can make it. Super duper easy. I'll leave everything that I did in the description so you can follow along. But it's just super easy. And of course, I will leave a link to the Ninja Speedy in the description because as you know, I've been telling you for almost a year now that this machine is absolutely fantastic. It's just a must have for you and your family or get it for someone that you know loves to cook with gadgets in the kitchen for sure. Absolutely. And of course, as always, I will, leave, I will pin into the comments my over 40 of my personal Ninja Speedy, Speedy videos um, in the comments so you could check them out again over 40 videos specific speedy videos how can you how can you lose check it out I'm sure there'll be at least five recipes that you could utilize including this one so just check it out you have nothing to lose but that's it enough of me rambling you need to go out get this ingredients make this for your family right now you can make this in your air fryer in any air fryer but Look at the playlist. There's a lot of things in the Speedy that you can't do in your air fryer, perhaps. So just check it out. But anywho, hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. If anything, thanks for just even looking at my video. It's Cooking with Doug. I'm out.